Hello, uh, very good evening to everyone. Apologies for the, the lack of videos. The weather has been pretty damn fabulous up in Scotland and it's been long, long overdue. September and this is the first good weather. Uh, so I've been out in the garden. Uh, the garden's looking lovely, although it's a bit late for all the flowers, but I've been working hard in the garden. And I've still been itching for World War Two, so I took a wee drive through today. I'm off. I was off. I've got three days off, so I took a wee drive down today to my friend Tom at Millicast. Uh, I've known Tom for many, many years, and used to paint figures and kits for Tom for his displays, and also helped him out with his first ever uh, catalog for Millicast. And I picked up some goodies for my upcoming World War Two stuff. Very excited actually, the cracking stuff, the battlefield range, a little KFZ-15 and I think it's a wee Stewart radio car, uh, Tom helped me out with the, the stuff, well, that's on the right hand side, and a uh, 250 Neuart uh, half track uh, and the support roll with a, a short barreled 75 gun and one a wee kit that I've always fancied. So I've got plans for getting paint, uh, the Johnson's clear, polish, etc. And I've also, oh yeah, I've got a Hetzer as well, that, that to add to my my Hetzer group. They were the first ones I think I'll be doing. Although I might sit and do these little cars tonight because they look quite easy to clean up and, and build. Now, my buddy Calm and I, we bought a U-boat each, Rebel U-boat. Uh, Calm was super detailing them and um, he's going to give me mine back for painting. I'm going to get back into it because I've got a place to display it now. And I got some of the, the Hecker and Goros U-boat uh, crew. Pretty pricey. £8, £9 a set. But you're only going to need them once. And they are pretty fab. They look pretty lovely. And um, when I was down seeing Tom, he gave me a 15mm storch that he had lying around the uh, white metal and resin. So thank you very much, Tom. Hey, well, I got an infrared for a half track as well. I always love the infrared stuff. I think I gave away my infrared figures that I've been working on. Uh, so ah, all, all exciting stuff. And a wee hang off it turret as well for a half track as well. So this is my purchases. Let's see if I can build some kits or paint some kits. Hope everybody's doing fine and happy work game. Oh sorry, live guard Cossacks. I will get back to you just when the weather changes again. But I'm getting a wee bit excited about my World War II stuff, looking through my old books and that. So happy war gaming. Bye for now.